Hi friends, hope you're all doing well. Hope you are enjoying this series of videos that we are doing on Tableau and hope your learning journey is coming along really well. And I also request you all to subscribe to our channel. And if you find the videos helpful, please do like them and share them with your friends and leave your feedback in the comment section so that we can take it and maybe, you know, implement your suggestions, whatever you have to say, you can let us know and we will take up your feedback. Okay, so thank you so much for your support. Uh, without much delay, let's proceed. So in the previous video, we had looked at geographical maps, which are used to represent geospatial data. Now we are going to talk about how do we sort the data in Tableau? What does it mean to sort? It means to arrange the data in a particular sequence. We might want the members to be arranged either in ascending order or in descending order or any sort of random sequence, okay, based on your requirement. So how do we arrange the members in a sequence? That is what sort means. So let's switch to Tableau and try it out. I'm going to look at the data for various subcategories and I will let's say, uh, look at the profit, okay, or let's take sales, okay, it'll be simple. Now, what is the sequence in which these members, members from the subcategory field are arranged over here? They are arranged in alphabetical order, isn't it? They are arranged in alphabetical order. And the bar is indicating the sales value. We already discussed how to understand or read or interpret a bar chart. That should not be a problem for you, right? So the length of the bar is indicating the value. Now, let's say I want to rearrange these members based on their sales information. How to sort the data? We can very easily and quickly sort the data by going towards the title on the axis, right? This is the axis and sales is the title. The moment I hover the mouse pointer towards the title, you see a sort icon appears. First click, when I click on it for the first time, data is sorted in descending order. If I click on it again, second click, data gets sorted in ascending order, increasing order. Third click, if I click on it again, it goes back to the default unsorted view where it's arranged in alphabetical order. Okay, first click descending, second click ascending, third click back to the normal view. So when we do this, exactly what is it that is getting rearranged here? The members on the header, the members in the subcategory dimension are getting shuffled. They are getting rearranged based on their sales value. So phones with the highest sales is at the top of the list. Chairs is in the second position. Storage is in the third position, so on and so forth. All right. And you will notice that the sort icon has appeared on the subcategory pill, not on the sales pill. We are sorting or rearranging the members from the subcategory dimension depending on the sales. So, depending on the sales, whether it is low or high, depending on that, these members are getting rearranged. And when you change their position, they will move around. Okay. How else can we sort the data? We can make use of the sort icons on the toolbar. So, when I click here, data will get sorted in descending order by sales, of course, because that is the measure used in the chart. And when I click here, it gets sorted in ascending order. How to clear the sort now? How do I go back to the unsorted view? So we need to go to the subcategory pill with the sort icon at the end. And when I hover the mouse pointer there, you see a small drop down arrow that will help us access a few more options. Okay, I will go here and I'm going to select the option to clear the sort. So only if you have sorted the data in any sequence, then the clear sort option will appear. And when you click on the clear sort option, you see that it's back to the original view. Now, 
let's say I want to sort these members based on profit. Though I'm representing sales in the chart, let's say I would like to sort it by profit. Now, how would that be possible? Because profit is not present in the graph. How can I sort it by profit? We can go to that pill, click on the drop down icon and choose the sort option. When I click on the sort option here, Tableau will open up a window where there is something called as sort by. By default, it is alphabetical or data source order. Now, I would like to sort by a field. Okay, I'm trying to sort it based on a field. Now, I have to choose the sort order. Let's say descending order. And I want to sort it based on, it's taking sales, but I want it by profit. So, I'll type in profit. Look at how the members are getting rearranged. These members are arranged based on their profit in descending order. So the most profitable member, copiers, is at the top of the list. And the least profitable member, tables, is at the bottom of the list. Okay, so let me show you by placing profit also in the screen. Look at that. So this is the most profitable member. This is the least profitable member. So the subcategories have now been sorted based on their profit, which we can see. All right, I will remove profit. Generally, we don't sort it on a field that is not in the graph. We always sort it on a field that is in the chart or indicate it in some way or the other. So I can also take profit to color. Look at the gradient. Dark blue to light blue to orange and dark orange. So most profitable to the least profitable. Okay. Let me clear this now. I'm going to clear the sort. So we can sort it based on any field of our choice by pulling up the sort window. Now I'm going to sort it using the sort icon on the toolbar. I'll turn on the mark labels. These members are rearranged based on their overall sales, right? The total sales from phones, almost 330,000 is at the top of the list. Then we have chairs, then we have storage in the third position. We have tables in the fourth place, so on, up to the last member, right? Now, I'm going to bring the date pill, which I will place before the subcategory pill over here, over here. What has happened? What is happening is Tableau remembers the original sequence. It knows that phones is number one. Second position goes to chairs. Third place, we have storage. Fourth place, we have tables. So it's memorizing this. And it is repeating the same sequence under every year, for every year, irrespective of the performance of those members in that year. The overall sequence is getting repeated. So in 2014, machines is in the third place. But according to Tableau, the default sequence is what? Phones, chairs, storage, tables. Somewhere down you have machines. Look at 2015. Over here, I have phones in the first place and chairs in the second place. However, chairs is the most profitable, uh, sorry, is the member with the highest sales. This, this should go to number one position. Phones should come down to number two. So what is happening? Tableau is not performing nested sort, right? Subcategory, here subcategory is nested under, sorry, under year. Subcategories are nested under the year field. Tableau is not looking at these new numbers, the performance of these members in that year. It's just going with the default original overall sequence. Okay, so we must tell Tableau to look at the nested information, look at the data in each year, look at the information nested under each year, then you rearrange them accordingly. So how do we do this? By performing nested sort. So I'll go to the subcategory pill. Pull up the sort window and ask Tableau to go with nested sort, nested in descending order. Now look at what has happened. It is looking at the data nested in each year. 
phones, then chairs, then machines came to the third position. Based on its performance in 2014, machines is in the third place. Look at 2015, chairs is number one. Number two is phones. Number three is storage. Number four is accessories. Machines is way down here. Okay, I hope you all understood the difference between a normal sort and nested. Generally, Tableau will automatically perform nested sort also. In case it doesn't perform nested sort, need not worry about it. You can go ahead, pull up the sort window and then perform nested sort. Okay, very, very useful feature. So that is about sorting, friends. I hope you all understood it. If you have any doubts or questions regarding sorting, please do leave it in the comment section and we'll get back to you. Please do like the videos, share them and uh, subscribe to the channel. All right. Thank you so much. Thank you all. Bye-bye.